The Babushka Lady, related to the assassination of JFK. The Babushka Lady is a nickname given to an unknown woman who was present during the assassination of John F. Kennedy on November 22, 1963, in Dallas, Texas. The name, Babushka, comes from the Russian word for, grandmother. As the woman was wearing a scarf or head covering that is commonly worn by older women in Russia and other Eastern European countries. Several photographs and films of the assassination show the Babushka Lady standing near the grassy knoll, a small hill on the northwest side of Dealey Plaza where many witnesses believe they heard shots coming from. She appears to be holding a camera, and some witnesses reported seeing her take photographs or film the events that unfolded. Despite the extensive investigation into Kennedy's assassination, the identity and whereabouts of the Babushka Lady remain a mystery. Several individuals claim to have seen her in the area, but none were able to identify her or provide any meaningful information about her. The FBI and other government agencies conducted extensive searches and investigations to try to identify the Babushka Lady, but their efforts were ultimately unsuccessful. Over the years, numerous theories have been put forward about who she might have been and what her role might have been in the assassination, but none have been proven. Some have suggested that the Babushka Lady was a foreign spy or government agent who was gathering intelligence at the scene. Others have speculated that she was a bystander who captured crucial evidence on film but was afraid to come forward due to fear of retribution. Still, others believe that she may have been involved in the conspiracy to assassinate Kennedy. Despite the mystery surrounding her identity, the Babushka Lady remains an iconic figure associated with one of the most significant events in American history. Why has the Babushka Lady at the assassination of JFK never been identified? The Babushka Lady at the assassination of JFK has never been identified despite extensive investigations by law enforcement agencies and private investigators over the years. There are several possible reasons why she has not been identified. Lack of clear evidence. Although there are photographs and films that show the Babushka Lady at the scene, the images are not clear enough to provide a definitive identification of the woman. Additionally, none of the footage or photographs captured a clear shot of her face, which makes it difficult to identify her. Fear of retribution. Some people believe that the Babushka Lady may have been afraid to come forward due to fear of retribution. The assassination of JFK was a traumatic and politically charged event, and it is possible that the woman may have feared for her safety if she were to come forward and identify herself. Lack of witnesses. Despite the large number of witnesses present at the scene of the assassination, none were able to identify the Babushka Lady. This may be because she was a relatively unknown figure in the area or because she blended in with the crowd and was not particularly noteworthy at the time. Conspiracy Theories The mystery surrounding the Babushka Lady has fueled numerous conspiracy theories over the years. Some people believe that she may have been involved in the conspiracy to assassinate JFK, and that her identity has been deliberately suppressed by those who do not want the truth to come out. In summary, the reasons why the Babushka Lady has never been identified are complex and may involve a combination of factors including a lack of clear evidence, fear of retribution, a lack of witnesses, and the influence of conspiracy theories. What legit theories are there for the Babushka Lady, of the JFK assassination, never revealing herself? There are several theories that have been put forward to explain why the Babushka Lady at the JFK assassination never revealed herself. Fear of retribution. One of the most commonly cited reasons is that the Babushka Lady may have been afraid to come forward due to fear of retribution. The assassination of JFK was a politically charged event, and the woman may have feared for her safety if she were to identify herself and speak out. Lack of importance at the time. It is possible that the Babushka lady did not realize the significance of what she had witnessed at the time of the assassination. She may have thought that her photographs or film footage were not important or relevant to the investigation, and therefore saw no reason to come forward. Unwillingness to get involved. Some people believe that the Babushka lady may have simply been unwilling to get involved in the investigation. She may have been a private person who did not want to become embroiled in the political controversy and media attention surrounding the assassination. Memory loss. Another theory is that the Babushka lady may have suffered memory loss or dementia in the years following the assassination, which could have prevented her from coming forward even if she had wanted to. Inability to identify herself. It is possible that the Babushka lady was a foreign national or undocumented immigrant who did not have proper identification or documentation, which could have made it difficult or impossible for her to identify herself. It is important to note that there is no conclusive evidence to support any of these theories, and the true reason why the Babushka lady never revealed herself remains a mystery. Finally, what happened to the Babushka lady? The fate of the Babushka lady at the JFK assassination remains unknown.
as her true identity has never been revealed. Despite extensive efforts by law enforcement agencies and private investigators over the years, the woman in the photographs and films has not been definitively identified, and her whereabouts and fate remain a mystery. There have been many theories and rumors about what may have happened to the babushka lady, including suggestions that she may have fled the country, changed her identity, or even died. However, there is no concrete evidence to support any of these theories, and the woman's true fate remains unknown. It is possible that she may still be alive and living anonymously somewhere, or that she may have passed away without ever revealing her true identity or her role in one of the most significant events in American history. Subscribe for more horrors and mysterious videos thanks.